Hey everyone, Christy with Anchor Life 5. Thanks for stopping by and joining me for a little bit today. I have another um, planner layout video to share with you all. Um, I'm calling this whole series Planning with a Non-Planner because I so want to be a planner girl, um, but I am not. <laughs> and when I watch other videos, I know why I'm not because there are so many amazing um, planner layouts out there. But I am dedicated to giving it a try um, every week for this year. So I have three different planners, notebooks that I am trying out to see what layout I like, what style, and all that kind of stuff. So let's start out with the Webster's Pages Traveler's Notebook. So this is my layout. Whoa! for this week. Now the one thing I don't like about this is that it is two weeks on two pages. Um, but I think that I'm doing pretty well with it. You know, looks like some weeks I've done, two weeks I've done the same thing and then I've done it a little bit different. So. Um, I really like the way that, that this one turned out. I did a lot of layering. Um, yeah, and I think that that turned out really pretty. And I believe, is this the notebook that I use? Yep, yeah, this is the notebook that I use uh, from Jen Hadfield at Hobby Lot, or at Tuesday morning. Just really, really gorgeous. Very feminine, very beautiful, kind of Victorian. Um, look to it all. I think I actually used that book for two different layouts this this um, this week because I really liked it. So that is that one in my Webster's pages. And then this is a Carpe Diem um, ring bound six ring bound uh, planning system. And I actually used this once again <laughs> in this one. Um, and I really, really love, love, love the way that this one turned out as well. So once again, I did a lot of layering. I didn't use any washi. I used only the stickers from the sticker pack. So there is that one. And then the last one, I am using a traveler's notebook that I made myself. And I'm doing a couple of different things in this one. So back here, I'm actually tracking my 1500 subscriber giveaway entries. So I've gotten quite a few there. So I'm tracking those um, in the back. And then I'm also doing, um, it's got personal stuff on there, but I am doing kind of like bullet journaling on these pages. Um, and just keeping track of, of different things. Um, and then I used this one. This is the um, American Crafts sticker book, also from Tuesday morning. They are incredible, beautiful sticker books they've had lately. So this one is black and gray and whites and golds. So that's the one that I used for this one. And here is this layout. So this one's more traditional. I kept, oh, that is crooked. I just now noticed that. Mm. Anyway, I kept with the, um, you know, this is in blocks like this one. It's a recollections insert. So I kept the block format um, in this one. So and here's some of the other ones that I've done um, since I started. That one's probably one of my favorite, the Reset Girl. That one. And then there is that one. And then this one. So, like I said, I'm really dedicated to to trying um, to do a layout once a week, or this would be three layouts a week. Um, and I'm doing so good so far. <laughs> but um, I appreciate y'all stopping by. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. 
And until next time, bye guys.